um, I had a woman come in for her bachelorette party. Oh, oh, I see where this is going. Yeah. We're students of local commercials. We know that the best ones are the ones that when you see them, you ask, how did this come about? So that's what our show answers. It doesn't just show you the commercial we created, but it shows you the entire process. They wanted me to put a certain something on her nail. An anatomically correct man. Yeah. And you fit that on one nail? Mm -hmm. Really in 48 hours, we've gone from not even knowing a business owner to conceptualizing and shooting his entire commercial. It's all about that process of what are we willing to go through in order to make a great local commercial. So, you know, we will do whatever it takes. If we're going to sell something to somebody, we want to experience it. So Ow, Lala, what are you doing? We go up to Sacramento, California to make a commercial for Fountain of Health Colonics. I think the average commercial directors would probably not say, you know what, in order to make a great commercial for this place, we need to get colonics. I, I, yeah, but you said that for us. That was your idea. I'm willing to do. I'm willing to do anything for. Well, this I was willing to do it. I did it, but I mean, I was also buried alive when we were making a commercial for a biodegradable casket company. Well, I came out like ten pounds lighter after that colonic, though. You, and you can tell he don't get braids, because I don't get complaints really from grown people. <laughs> grown people. <laughs> we started becoming students of what people wanted to see and the kinds of things that got a lot of views on the internet, and we started seeing that people were uploading local commercials from their area, put them up there on YouTube, and they started going viral. We we're like. Well, what if we started sort of channeling that same spirit that makes a classic local commercial, one, something that could go viral, something that you want to share, but actually do it with real employees for real businesses? The new me! <laughs> we had to make a commercial for a place in Vegas called Designated Drivers. Now, this is a service that if you're too drunk to drive, they actually come and pick you up and drive you home in your own car. So the idea is we got to create a commercial that you watch when you're sober, but then when you're hammered later, you remember it. You recall the number. So that means write a jingle. And this is how our jingle went. I'm hammered out of my mind. Gonna call for five, six, ride.